Yeah. Will Smith plays Richard Williams, father of future tennis stars Venus and Serena. So it's a biographical sports drama. Um, having been sort of variously portrayed in the media as, on the one hand, you know, inspirational, charismatic trainer who, you know, achieved this extraordinary level of success, also seen on the other side as overbearing, self-serving, tyrannical, blah, blah. So as, as portrayed by Will Smith, kind of comes out more on the side of somebody who basically wants to do the best for their family and indeed for themselves, but who can be overbearing. Uh, Angelo Ellis is um, Brandy, um, his partner and their mother, who is the only person who seems able to stand up to his more overbearing tendency and, and to kind of and to remind him that these decisions are not made solely without anyone else. Here's a clip. Are we a team? Are we a team? We, we're a family. So we're a team? We're a family, the best and kind of team you don't think that is. that was a decision that you should have discussed with me? Discussed with Venus? Richard, my faith dictates that I stand by your side. Right, well, don't do mistake that, my silence for agreement. You do that again, and I won't be quiet. Now, don't do that. Don't do that to me. You don't make a fool out of me. Who made a fool out of you? What, you, you, what, you made what a fool are you out of me. About? Don't make a fool out of me. Ain't nobody made no fool out of you. So you hear from that, it's Will Smith, right? Will Smith is an unbelievably likeable screen presence, OK? So Serena and Venus both have executive producer credit. So this is an authorised, yeah. you know, within the family thing. That said, it isn't uncritical. I mean, what you do see, as I said, broadly speaking, it's somebody who is trying to do the best for their family, somebody who is overbearing, somebody who is uh, exasperating, but clearly somebody who only managed to achieve what they managed to achieve by being exasperating because they are, what they're attempting to do is find an entrance into the rich, you know, white enclave of the US tennis scene. And everywhere they go, they are met either with it closed doors or equally patronisingly with people saying, wow, you've done brilliantly. Well done you in that, in that mm -hmm. way. And of yeah. course, and his response to all of this is immediately to rise to the bait, not to take any of it. So he is definitely portrayed as hard work. And we definitely see him through, Brady through Orison's um, eyes, as somebody who needs to be, you know, Oh, yes, fine, that's great, but we can't take the whole package on board. It is an interesting story. I mean, it's there's there is there's no denying that this is a, a, a real kind of triumph of you know determination, getting stuff done. And, and I mean, a lot of sports stories, I don't know anything about the sport at all. It's impossible to be alive and not know about the extraordinary success. Yeah, well, we did the show from Wimbledon. We did this, did... I know, but I mean, I've done the show from places where I mean, I did the show from a Formula One track once. I've got no idea what the things were. We just stood there and every now and then something went, Mew! And I, that, is, I, that is true. I don't know what's going on. Then that chap came in and said he didn't understand Shrek because it ended up with somebody deciding not to be ugly. Jensen Button. Him. Yeah, anyway, but in the case of this, it's I think what it it the reason it works is because I mean there's a you know, good solid performances all the rest of it, but Will Smith does a lot of the heavy lifting in terms of you do like his character, you do and it's that old thing about, you know, you have to have somebody to root for, even if they're irascible, even if they're difficult, even if they're overbearing, or you do broadly have to be on side with them. And I think that what this does is it negotiates an interesting path between... It's not It's not something that pretends that everything was easy. It's not something that completely puts aside all criticisms, but it is something that is from within the family and therefore ultimately is that story. And it worked for me. I mean, I you know, you find yourself absolutely cheering and rooting at the right moments and it has an... I won't spoil it, but it has an interesting narrative arc. Again, we'll say... You know, you look back at any sports movies, it is amazing how much Rocky lays out the templates for uh, things like that. But I thought it was pretty solid, and not least because Will Smith is very good in the lead. Back in the years when I was doing lots of prep for uh, Five Lives Wimbledon coverage yeah. and, uh, and and based down there for the afternoon yeah. programme, I bought lots of books about tennis players, tennis stars, and my favourite book yeah. about Venus Williams had the fantastic title, Venus Envy. And uh, Wow. Still to be recommended. That's very good.